Something strange is happening inside our own solar system. The path of 3I Atlas passes just 9 degrees to Perth from the source of the famous WOW signal detected in 1977. Could this be a coincidence or something that was planned long before we ever knew it existed? Its behavior is breaking the laws of physics as we understand them. And just as the world is searching for answers, NASA, the most powerful space agency on Earth, has suddenly gone silent. What are they hiding? And why now? It started with a moment of silence, one that felt heavier than usual. For months, the world had followed 3I Atlas, the mysterious interstellar object racing through our solar system. Most of what we knew came from NASA. Their telescopes had first confirmed the object's strange speed and hyperbolic path, proof that it came from beyond our solar system. The James Webb Space Telescope analyzed its light spectrum, detecting traces of water vapor and carbon dioxide long before it ever neared the sun. NASA's early reports described it as unlike any comet or asteroid ever observed. Then, all of a sudden, the updates stopped. On October 7, 2025, while NASA's data channels went dark, the European Space Agency stepped forward. ESA released the clearest photos ever captured of 3I Atlas, taken not by deep space telescopes, but by the ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter and Mars Express, two probes orbiting Mars that had never been meant for this kind of observation. To capture the object, engineers pushed their instruments beyond design limits, adjusting software, extending exposure times, and redirecting their communication systems to detect a target over 100,000 times dimmer than their usual focus. When the first image appeared, it stunned the control room. It showed a faint sphere of light, surrounded by a misty halo that shimmered against the blackness of space. The object didn't reflect sunlight like a comet. It glowed softly, as if something inside it was alive. ESA released the photo to the public within hours, describing it as an unexpected pattern of light behavior. At that exact same moment, NASA went completely silent. The high-rise camera aboard the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, capable of the sharpest planetary imaging ever made, suddenly stopped transmitting data. No new updates appeared on official NASA channels. No explanation was offered. The shutdown of the US government was the reason given, but the timing raised eyebrows everywhere. To the public, it looked like two worlds colliding. On one side, ESA, transparent, open, sharing every image and calibration file. On the other, NASA, silent, dark and unreachable. One agency handed the mystery to the world. The other shut its doors. Even more curious was what NASA had last shown before going dark. Days earlier, the Perseverance rover had captured a faint streak across the Martian sky, believed to be 3I Atlas during its approach. NASA confirmed the sighting, but never released the high-resolution version. It was said that the high-rise could have captured the object with clarity, unmatched by any other camera in the solar system. But when ESA's photos appeared, NASA's feed froze mid-update. ESA, meanwhile, invited the world in. They published the raw data and even encouraged citizen scientists to process the images themselves. Yet hidden inside ESA's data was something no one could explain. The path of 3I Atlas wasn't random at all, and its alignment with the planets looked almost deliberate. When astronomers plotted the orbit of 3I Atlas, they expected chaos. An object arriving from another star system should have entered our solar neighborhood at a random angle. Instead, what they found left even the most experienced scientists speechless. The path of 3I Atlas was almost perfectly aligned with the ecliptic plane, the flat disk on which all the planets orbit the Sun. Its tilt was only 4.89 degrees, a difference so small that it had less than a 1% chance of happening by coincidence. No other interstellar object, not even Oumuamua or Borisov, had ever traveled this way. That was only the beginning of the mystery. As the data came in from multiple observatories, another pattern appeared. The object had passed near Mars, Venus and Jupiter, the only three planets positioned for ideal observation at that exact time. It wasn't just close. The timing was almost surgical. When Mars was at its nearest point for ESA's orbiters to observe, 3I Atlas swept by within 18.6 million miles. Weeks later, it approached Venus at the best viewing angle for Earth-based telescopes. And by late October, Jupiter's massive gravity lined up perfectly to give a potential slingshot trajectory toward the Sun. To many, it looked like a cosmic coincidence. 
To others, it felt planned. One researcher called it the perfect flyby. The more scientists analyzed the trajectory, the more questions surfaced. If 3i Atlas had entered from deep interstellar space, how did it find a path so precisely matched to the solar system's geometry? And why did it cross the planetary plane at the exact moment our most advanced probes were able to see it? Some experts pointed to gravitational dynamics. Small nudges from passing stars or galactic dust could alter an orbit over millions of years. But even that didn't explain the accuracy. Simulations showed that for 3i Atlas to appear exactly where it did, the odds were less than 1 in 10,000. A few theorists quietly began to ask whether the alignment might not be an accident at all. Public reaction grew louder once ESA's data became open source. Online forums exploded with visual models tracing the orbit, showing perfect lines between the planets as if following a pre-programmed route. Headlines called it the most suspicious trajectory in modern astronomy. And yet, with every new observation, the mystery only deepened. Because 3i Atlas wasn't just moving precisely, it was accelerating. That acceleration would soon reveal even stranger behavior, changes in speed, light, and composition that no comet or asteroid could mimic. From the moment the first detailed data arrived, the behavior of 3i Atlas began to challenge everything we thought we knew about comets. Scientists estimated the nucleus of 3i Atlas to be somewhere between approximately 320 meters and 5.6 kilometers across. Based on images captured by the Hubble Space Telescope from July 2025, that size alone would make this interstellar visitor far larger than many known comets. Yet it grew even stranger when researchers combined size with motion. Despite clearly shedding material and releasing dust and gas, 3.i Atlas hardly showed any of the wobble or thrust we would expect from an outgassing body. In a typical comet, jets of vapor act like tiny rocket thrusters, nudging the nucleus slightly off its path. Here, the implied acceleration was so small that scientists calculated the mass must be immense enough to resist those forces, pointing to a mass estimate of 33 billion tons or more. Even stranger was the way it reflected light. Polarimetric data showed 3.i Atlas had an extreme negative polarization branch, reaching a minimum of 2.77% at a phase angle of approximately 6 to 7 degrees. This feature is unprecedented in comets observed in our solar system and implies its dust or ice grains are shaped or composed in a way unlike any known object. The chemistry too betrayed oddities. Spectroscopic observations found that the object contained a relative abundance of CO2 early in its journey and noticeable water ice grains, even when more than six astronomical units from the sun, far colder and darker than typical comet territory. It also lacked iron where we'd expect it, and showed dust grains behaving more like those in trans-Neptunian objects than classic comets. In short, it looked like a comet, but didn't act like one. The combination of size, mass, light reflection patterns and composition forced many researchers to ask, is this simply a strange natural body or something else entirely? One astrophysicist described the object as a record breaker in every sense, because it outmasses previous interstellar objects by orders of magnitude and yet behaves more like a spacecraft than a snowball of ice and rock. Of course, the predominant view remains that it's natural, just extremely unusual. But even among scientists, the word unexplained keeps coming up. And as 3i Atlas continues its journey toward perihelion, the gap between expectation and reality only widens.